So I'm gonna to talk to you about the three main stocks that I'm watching right now that are set to make a really big move. Hint, one has already started. And that's what I wanna share with you in today's video. So let's get into the very first one that I wanna share with you, and that is the Russell 2000. The entire year this year, I've been really, really focused on the Russell. Um, I've always said that I believe that the Russell is likely to make big moves. In fact, for my private clients, this is something that I was actually teaching my, a show on my private clients. Um, I'm so glad, I'm just so proud of my private clients. Uh, let me just show you this here, right? So I wanna show you, this is, this is a whole bunch of screenshots that for me and my private clients um, do uh, take all the time. If you're interested in um, actually learning how I actually trade the markets, guys, like my actual trading system, then the very first thing in the description there, click on that, you can go join my next webinar training and on that webinar, I'll teach you the exact, all, all the details to my actual trading system. And then on that webinar, if you do wanna have a chance to actually work with me, then you, you then you can you can apply for it there. But if not, at least on the webinar guys, you'll be able to see exactly how I trade the market. So just go get the help, right? So anyway, so there's a whole bunch of uh, different screenshots that all my me and my private clients have taken. As you can see, private client group, but look at this here. 35 members, right? So if you do apply to become a member, my group, my private client group is really, really, really small. Um, so, and and I have, and this is this is the private client group and my, uh, my live room that's with me every day, that's only around about 15 people. So I keep the group really, really, really small. So if you're ever wondering what do I do and stuff like that, um, and if you ever do be, apply to become a coaching client, just know that most time I say no to people, um, but every now and then I do let someone else in. So um, if you uh, if you actually, or if you do want to apply to become a coaching client, then just go to getjohnshelp.com. That's getjohnshelp.com. You can apply, you can actually fill out the application form and I'll personally call you. But here's the thing, right? On June the 9th here, I said, hey traders, I've been analyzing all the markets for the last three hours and so many amazing things that are setting up right now, okay? So this is June the 9th. Over one month ago, I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> Sorry. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm gonna sneeze again. <coughs> all right, I think I got it. So one of them, one of them is this. Check out this image. Below the monthly charts, and you can see the S&P 500, the NASDAQ, the Dow, and um, the NASDAQ, the Dow, and the uh, NASDAQ, S&P, NASDAQ, and Dow, all had 50% retracements and a move higher. So what I'm gonna talk about here is this, okay? So um, you can see here on the NASDAQ, this whole point through here was a 50% retracement and then a race to new highs. I then mentioned the NASDAQ. NAS, uh, that was, uh, uh, I mentioned in the S&P. S&P, that was a 50%, meaning that the low of the, the COVID crash to the boom, to the dip was a 50% and then a race to new highs. Same for what? Same for the Dow Jones too, right? Check out this. This one gets really, really, really awesome, guys. This is, I, I just live, eat and breathe this stuff, right? So what we have here is this, right? We have a big move up. And then guess what? We came down and we had a 50% retracement before what? Racing to the old highs of the COVID, right? But, but, this is where it gets pretty cool. Look at this here. But the Russell, which has made a massive time phase for the last two years. Now, a time phase for you guys, if you don't know what a time phase is, I'm a time phase is, I call these, I call these refueling phases, right? Refueling phases. And so therefore, um, this this is the this is the Dow Jones here monthly chart. All this here is really not doing much for that entire what's that probably couple of years there, as you can see. This is one of the reasons why right now I see a Dow Jones being fifty thousand. That but that's not one of the markets. That's actually a bit of a bonus for you guys, right? And as we can see, this is point through. So this here this is the uh, the Dow Jones, and this is where I believe we can start to see a really 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 big move uh, to the upside. So. Let's go and have a look at, oh, let's go back to this screenshot here. Right, so look at this here. So we can see that's, that's what happened with the Dow Jones. That's why I see the Dow Jones being 50,000. But again, that's a bit of a bonus, but that's not part of the three. The first one is the Russell. So look at the Russell. The Russell is the only one, the only one low, up, down, 50% retracement, and now, 
This is the Russell back a month ago. And I was letting people know about the Russell one month ago, right? One month ago. And the, and actually more than that, actually for the entire year, my private client group, guess what? I've been really helping them and focusing on them to really help them go through this process here. And I'm saying that, listen, the Russell's going to catch up. There, there's, there's gonna, there's gonna, this here is going to be a really nice move. And so I've been watching, if I'm watching it and watching it. And if I actually go down to the now, let's go to the Russell, right? And yesterday, yesterday I said in the Russell, guys, look, we're getting started. And today we had a really big gap up today. So there's a lot of buying activity. So guess what is probably starting to happen now? So what's, what's probably starting to happen now? We're, start, we're starting to what? We're starting to capitalize on now this actually raising up to at least this high here. But I actually have a 300 target or 3000 target for the futures there, right? So if I go to this one here, I, if I squeeze my charts up, the first target would be where? Where's the first target? Just to the highs. Remember I said before, like all the other indices have done that. So why isn't the, why wouldn't the Russell do that? Now the Russell's starting to kick in, guess what? That's the unloved child, right? So see where a lot of you guys, when you're looking for trading opportunities, you're trying to jump in something that's already made massive moves. Like not for me, right? I want to get in, I want to get into something that hasn't made a big move. So if I do get into it and it does make a big move, I can have a really big reward for a small risk, right? That's what it's all about. So the first market on this one here, and I've been warning for this, you can see here from the June the 9th, um, I actually put this out here for my private clients. Um, and you can see that through there. So anyway, so this is this is the first one that I do see. The second one that I, um, the, the second market that I do see is the energy sector. So check this out here. So the energy sector here, for this is the XLE. So one thing I see, I'm seeing with the energy sector is I'm seeing this actually, this massive resistance through here. And now we're going through what I call a rebuild. We're going, we're going through a classic, what's called a fueling phase, refueling. See how this is more like, it's, it's, like, it's like a bit of a bit of a channel going down, right? Notice how this was very strong to the upside. And now we're just doing this. What is that? See how it's just doing that? So if I zoom in a bit more and to show you a bit more of that, that'd be the, that'd be like the, the channel coming down. Whenever you start to get this type of pattern here, guys, okay? So whenever you see this pattern here, so look at this here. See how it's it's going down, but it's going very weak down, right? Now we're doing this thing here. Guess what I believe is coming? This one here. And if that does happen, and we start to get back above that level through there, this level all through here, guess what? Once it, once it gets back above here, we are about to take on some serious price action. So the XLE chart, and this is the same for the XOM. XOM, which is the, is another stock within this sector, that's doing something really similar as well too. So there's this energy sector too, you guys. So the first sector, which I've been talking about for the entire year, which is the Russell, and now it's confirmed, and now guess what? I'm already in really, really nice profit already from day one. So beautiful, beautiful, beautiful trade there. Um, energy sector, I'm getting ready for that one there. So that's the second one through here. Uh, and let me go back to the energy sector here. And also, so as you can see through there, right? So you can see this one here. So I'm getting ready for a really breakout. If so, guys, as you can see, right? Um, people are focused on S&P 500, the NASDAQ and Bitcoin and AI stocks and all these markets that have really big moves. Me, I'm scouring the market looking for these gold gems, right? So while everyone was focused on all the AI stocks, get was I, what was I focusing on? The Russell, why? Because it's getting ready to move. I'm gonna get in before the big move, right? All the other ones that had big moves. Let's actually go find something that has a big move. Make, makes sense, right? And now we have the XLE. Now, the last one, the very last one is the XLV. And it's, we're actually just getting a breakout right now, which is quite nice. But the XLV right now, which is the health sector, guess what? What is the biggest sector it's gonna be in the next 10, 20 years? The health sector, right? The health sector is going to be that. That's, and especially things like rejuvenative, like saunas and spas and, you know, all that sort of stuff, you know, and then obviously when they start to do like things like, you know, implants, meaning like chips and brains and 
you know, things are helping with their health and so on and so forth. Like that sector, the, the health sector is going to be huge for the baby boomers. So from a technical point of view, we just started the breakout now, which is quite nice, really, really nice. Um, but what also is what I also see on the on the health sector is that I see this here. Um, I see that uh, that again from from a technical point of view, we've done nothing for all this time here, right? Check this out. So nothing for all this time through here. And now we're just breaking out. Now we're starting. We went from no trend at all, no trend, to now we're just starting a trend through there. So three main markets, actually four four markets for you guys, really. Um, uh, really, the first one, which is the Dow Jones, I show I shared that with you. Why I see fifty thousand Dow Jones. The second one is the Russell, which has already happened and it's already moving already. Um, and I've been warning you about the Russell. If you're watching, if you, if you watch my, my entire year, I've been warning about the Russell. And that's already happening right now. So I'm really, really nice profit already on day one on this trade. Um, uh, the second one or the third one is the health sector, right? And then the fourth one is uh, the fourth one is so that the, the health sector and the fourth one is the energy sector. So there's a lot of opportunity here, guys, away from the what people are focused on right now, AI, and um, Bitcoin and, and all this sort of stuff. Actually, when it comes to Bitcoin, I think there's some opportunities there, but I hope you can see guys, this is what I'm looking at here. So hope this helps you out there today, traders. Traders, if you'd like to learn exactly how I trade the markets, then on that webinar, link in the description, I'll teach you exactly how to do that. If you'd like to apply to become part of my coaching group where I'm coaching you and doing this stuff with you every single day and also when I do get into a trade like I did with the Russell yesterday, you see me do this live in the markets so you can take advantage of this sort of stuff, then just go to get John's help, get J-O-H-N-S help.com, get John's help.com. You'll be able to fill out the application form and I'll personally call you to see if you guys are a good fit. Hope this helps guys.